Welcome back, boys and girls. And today we're gonna talk about how we set up Sky's crater and the playpen. And the biggest debate that we had in the house since day one. And that was we're gonna let Sky sleep at night. Okay, before we got Sky, my wife and I both had a very good understanding Sky is not going to sleep with us in the bedroom, otherwise he's gonna get spoiled and I'm gonna have a problem sleeping at night. And when Joseph saw Sky, he just fell over the hill with Sky. And he was really concerned about letting us sleep by herself and insisted that we should have Sky in our room or in his room. But I stood my ground and I told him we gotta go with the plan and let's try a couple of days and see if it works out. And if it doesn't, then we could always have the other option. But if we start with having a pup in the room, she'll never sleep alone. First night, she cried a lot, she howled and cried, and my wife actually ended up going downstairs around 2.30 and stayed with her till about 3.30 and came back up. And even after that, she cried. Now, second night, she did much better. She did really well last night. It is now 5.25 in the morning. First night, she cried a lot, but second night, she did very well. Good girl, Sky. Good morning, Sky. Foka. Hmm. All right, let's see. Okay, you can see that there's a three urine spot, and she took a little poop right there. Good girl, Sky. Good girl, Sky. Now, you never want to pick the pup up from the plate pan, but let her walk out to the crater. Good girl, good girl, Sky, good girl. And you want to leave the cradle open during the daytime. Let her know this is not a jail, but her safe place. And she always does that. Uh, every time she gets a little scared or something, she'll come here and go back to her blanket. Now this is the blanket that uh, the breeder gave us, which the Sky's been using, so she really feels safe in there. And now I gotta clean up the poop and the urine. Now the toilet, she's done a very good job being a toilet train and she did very well because she hasn't made any mistakes yet. Now first thing in the morning you want to take her outside and let her do her thing. So let's go out. Okay every time you come out you want to put a leash on her so that she knows the leash is not a bad thing and it means it's time to go out. Okay Sky. Okay Sky do your thing. Now she just took a pee in the morning on her path, so I'm not sure if she's gonna go or not. So we're gonna give her maybe another couple of more minutes and see how she does. Sky? No. Come here. Come here. No, 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 Sky, come here. Come here, Sky. Good girl, good girl. Hello, Sky. Hello, Sky. Hello, Sky. Hello, Sky. Hello, Sky. Hello, Sky. She hold the cross. She's going toward the sun. Wow. Whoa. She's brave. Yeah, we've been out here for more than 10 minutes now and she's not gonna go, so we gotta go inside. Only on third night, she actually slept to the whole night without single peep. And she got up around 6 a.m. And that's when I went down to see her. Okay, it's now 6.25 and she, she slept through the whole night. She just got up. Good girl, Sky. Such a good girl, Sky. Oh, she took a poop of twice. Come on, Sky. 
Now she knows where to come out. Good girl. Good girl. And let's go out for a little walk. Good morning, Sky. Good morning. Good morning, Sky. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning, Sky. Did you miss me all night? You've been a, such a good girl, Sky. You slept through the whole night. You miss me all night, huh? She missed us all night, so she wants to play with us a little bit. All right, let's go do your thing. And lastly, like always, thank God for what you have in your life with what you got, but mostly remember, you have to discipline yourself before you could discipline others. See ya.